Well, folks, Sheila and Dalkis, Janet Cook, 21st of February. Time is 5 past 10. I'm waiting for people to arrive. <laughs> they were on time. I'll just shut down and I'll catch you later. Also a bit of shelter from the wind as well, because if the wind gets behind this, no matter what we put behind oh, it, it'll it, be off. it does. Uh, so <laughs> a very friendly yeah. sign that keeps coming to say hello to you, smack. Things are blown. <laughs> You could get some weight to put on the job. That's right. Or a piece of string. Or something. Or we'll do the other thing. Colin, would you like to say a few words, please, before the... Well, it's a fantastic day here in Dalkeith. We've got blue skies, we've got sunshine, and we've got a street stall. And we've got some good people here handing out leaflets for our candidate. Fantastic day. Thank you very much, Colin. Um, we have wristbands, pens, key rings. Well, I can't, you better hear if I don't. Oh, like, sorry. We'd like coffee. Yeah. That's a good idea, yes. Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Hey, do you want coffee? Uh -huh. Yeah, lovely. Sugar milk? Uh, two sugar, two sugar, sugar, sugar for me. Two sugar? Two sugar and milk, Colin. Milk. See, there are good people down here. I'm talking to good people, Colin. Good people down here. I'm still in Dark Keith, by the way. Hello. You can see. I'm following for YouTube and. I don't know. I usually, I usually go and ask. I think, I, I used to was across talking to me. I think the joke. Oh no! Well, I move it a wee bit. Pop, pop this people here. The sunshine out there. And I'm going to get a heat. Uh, oh. Cold, cold day again. I'm not talking to myself here. I'm talking to the camera. <laughs> Thank you. And my phone never stops. Uh, yeah. Let's see what's going on. I'm heading to the sun. Yeah. I thought it'd be rather busy here today. Yes, I'm busy. Oh, is that cool? Is that Owen there? Yes, it is. I am off to see Owen Thompson. So bear with me a minute. Get through this big crowd here. <laughs> oh. He has arrived. Well, ladies, on you go. Right, thank you. Thank you. I'm going down. Oh, we have a discussion going on. Hey, but we're going to run in the circle. I hear it, Doc. This is Scott and the mind of the rain. The rain in it, Jess. I mean, if you can mind the rain in it, Jess, I mean, can you be alright? And we're not too much privatising ours, we're the opposite. No. But you've got way more. So that's why we need SNP MPs, because if we continue privatising the South, uh -huh. it'll cut the budget, uh -huh. which will cut our budget. Uh -huh. And whether we want it or not, uh -huh. we're going to have an impact. Because you know that's how the Barnett formula works, uh -huh. with this balance of scales, uh -huh. what they cut, what's we, it have, we have to. What's the chance to score have another election? Oh, very good. Yeah, yeah. That'll be there. Um, it's, a matter, it's, it's a matter of time. It's a matter of time. You've got a number of things. I mean, obviously, they made a lot of promises after the referendum about more powers and all that sort of stuff. At the moment, they're not delivering on that. So I think we could legitimately say, well, you we promised us, you've not done it, so we're having another go. Um, you could argue that it went to manifesto for the Scottish Parliament for the 2016 elections to say, elect us, we'll have another go. That way you could be having a referendum, maybe 2017, 18. I don't think it'll be much beyond 2020 at the latest. Because there's an appetite yeah. for change, and at the moment we're not seeing them well, you see, you see if the Well, if the last referendum, all right, they never done it. You went, people have joined the SAP, it's unbelievable now. And still joining? Still joining, yeah. I mean, I mean, I thought Disney gave, uh, I thought Disney gave, like, Mace Minister, I mean, the, the look in Scotland, I mean, I mean, 
Red Tory. Yeah, they totally are. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. No, yeah. it's uh, it's everything to play for, right? Well, now. We're feeling really we, optimistic. We've got nothing to lose. Well, we've got a lot to lose if we don't put strong voices in to stand up for what we've got. Aye. Because the, 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 the danger people. is that if they continue to push against what we're trying to do in Scotland, mm -hmm. that they'll cut back more and more and more on the budget that we've got, which is all that we've really got to be able to work with. The Westminster cut that back, it will impact on what we have here. So we absolutely need to have MPs in Westminster from the SNP to say... Is Alex Salmon still going to do this He's standing for an MP, yeah. This year or what? Yeah, same election. In fact, if you look at some of the national news, of the UK national news, all they're talking about is how excited. I know. Would you ever have believed it? It's hilarious. I think, think here, I think the boys and David Cameron have been joining himself. Ken, he will be smash himself for a table or something, I mean. He will be with some butt head. will be one. What was Ken. Ruth Davidson talking about yesterday on the platform? Rubbish. <laughs> oh, that? Oh, she's another complete idea. If you want to vote, just keep scoring. I don't want to people behind her. I dropped my camera on the ground, the concrete, I hope, hope it's recording all right. We will soon find out. <laughs> I have parked my car in the bus stop. Only if I'll get arrested today again. I shall see. What I tell you, I'm perishing cold again. <laughs> but I'm no fear. I will not give in. I'll interview you on shortly. I'll be back in a minute. How are you doing? So I don't drop it this time. I'm on the move again. Let's see what's going on here. You are on form. <laughs> Oh, it's so good to see you Hello. Hello. Hello, honey, how are you? I'm not fine, just I was just saying to your mum how well she looks like. What a difference. So, how are you feeling with this morning? Oh, that is a good one. Oh, folks, this is Owen Thompson. Owen, carry on. What have you got to say today? Well, we're out in Dalkeith this morning. We've had a, a great response from the, the members who are out helping campaign for uh, me to sell me down to Westminster and uh, take out the Labour stronghold in the blow then. I think it's a uh, great response from the local residents that were speaking to this morning. And yeah, all in all, it's a sunny day, it's a lovely day, and everyone's having a great time. Oh, the hell must be bloody cold then. <laughs> Didn't say it was warm, I said it's, it's sunny. <laughs> Thank you very much, Owen, and best of luck to you. Cheers, cheers. Thank you. Oh, what are you mucking me about for? What are you doing to me? Just trying to highlight my, uh, my little thing, a little notice. Could you explain this, please? Yes, it's Funny. got various numbers. 79, 83, 87, 92 and 10. Why? Is it your lottery numbers or is it because Scotland voted Labour and got Tory? The law. The second one is correct, sir. I did you that. You win the prize. Thank you. What did I get? Right? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> freedom. Freedom, yes. We Thank get, you very much. We get freedom. Sorry, folks, I'm getting knocked about here again. Yeah, yes! Yay!
freedom. We are back in the old routine here. Back in the old yes campaign. Yes, thank you. Oh. Yes, man. Sorry, yes, for freedom. I have sun here. And I can't see a thing now. Sorry, darling, it's all right. Alright. Oh. <laughs> There's your memory, folks. Interview here. Well, you can do an interview, but wait till we've done Hello, it. Hello, how are you today? Oh, no. You are on live, darling. How are you? I'm fine. How are things going? Uh, with the campaign? A bit slow, but uh, I think uh, things like this, street events, actually talking to the candidate and working out what we're going to do in the next few days, is, uh, it's quite useful. And we've got Owen. Owen, do you want to come and speak to Owen? I've done a wee bit before. Have you? Come on, dear. Come on. No, two together. That's it, that's it. Come on. <laughs> Can I stop with this? What are you saying? I can't remember what you're saying. We're now in Bonnerig. Yes. I've moved up for the Alpine to Bonnerig. There's a great crowd here as well. Brilliant response. So that's shown me that across Midlothian people are ready for a change. They're ready for something new. And it's time to say we've had enough of the Labour Party. We've had enough of them failing the communities in Midlothian. It's time to vote SNP in the coming general election. Absolutely. To hell with the Tories. <laughs> Let's get rid of the red and the blue Tories. Sorry, I'm shaking, folks. I'm, I'm freezing. It's all right, my, my feet are <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, Thank thanks. you very much indeed. Sorry. I was going. I'm on now. Can you start again, please? Take two. Take two. <laughs> take two. Fracking protest, take two. <laughs> There's a meeting in the last week high school, 25th of February. This is to protest against fracking in Scotland. That is. Um, putting high pressure chemicals into rocks and fracturing them so that you can extract the gas. Which is so very well, it's a short term thing, but it uh, causes huge amounts of pollution and possible earthquakes and other damage and stuff. There's far better things in Scotland, renewables, that we could use than fracking. Short term is of money? No. Let's go for the long term community renewables based stuff. There you go. Thank you very much, James, you're a gentleman. Cheers. Thank